So what's up everybody, my name is Andrew Chungosas and today I'm going to take you through my caricature process. I mean like how to make this big head, smaller legs and how to just make the whole thing pop up. And yeah, so I'm going to be speed lapsing. I mean I'm going to put in a fast forward motion and I'm going to show you how it goes. Now let's dive right to it. Now first, the first thing I do is to cut out the picture from the background. Yeah, I'm going to be doing that. I'm going to tell you a story as well. It's going to be like a commentary video where i give a story of how i started using photoshop it's a very fun interesting story with love cries down the line so just listen while i tell you and i tell you what i'm doing i'm going to basically cut out the picture from the background then after that i'm going to cut out the different components and so let's start with our story first i loved cartoons a whole lot it was not cartoons mainly it was vector art if you can really remember when people did vector art that right? was vector art and vector art was so very nice because it was very rampant then I, I, quite a lot of persons did it then i felt like yeah i could try to do this but then i didn't have a laptop and i was in university i think like a 200 level or 100 level i had the laptop once and i gave it to a friend and he kind of smashed the screen by mistake and i never saw the laptop anymore but that was like in 2017 and then i felt like i loved cartoons and then yeah so Pause from the story. Now I just added the highlights just to give you a feel. Now continue back to my story, and then I went on IT. IT means industrial training. If you're in university, that's what you go to when you're in 300 level. I mean to get involved in what you're doing. So I studied computer science from the university. So it kind of helped. It helped me um, in line with what I was doing. Now. So at one point I told my mom, man, I need to get a laptop, and then she went. I thought if you know Nigeria mothers very well, she, I, I thought you had a laptop. What you can't do your laptop? And uh, if I, well, I had saved up a little cash, so I got a laptop eventually. And then came the biggest part: installing Photoshop. Then I had senior colleagues that said, "Okay, can you help me install Photoshop?" Pause from the story. I just added highlights to this just to make it sharper. Then I'm going to quickly smudge. I usually oil paint for smudging, but this time around, since it's a speed lab tutorial. I'm just smudging, then add oil paint after all. Do you understand? Continue back to the story. Now, I installed Photoshop on the system. I can remember going to disturbing one of my senior colleagues that was in final year. And then finally, I'm not sure he did give me the, you know, he didn't give it to me. I think a friend gave it to me, just Photoshop. And then I installed it. I think it was CS6 and C, um, CX 2017 or something like that, that, that had this white feel. Now, I, I can't show you any of those pictures now because, I mean, we are doing this and you are watching and listening to my voice. But however, I got this and then getting it was very funny. It was very funny, but I, I was, I, I did not know that YouTube was very handy in getting any of these things. So, I mean, I'll just put a picture inside and I'm, I'm there over and over and over again. And yeah, one of the days they told me that I have just a few days left for it to expire. And I'm like, oh, it does expire. I really did not know that it does expire. But, well, I felt like, okay, I'm going to try to do that. Uh, pause for the story. Now, what I'm doing right now is smudging. I'm using the smudge brush that is in, like, all, virtually all my videos and smudge. And now I'm going to add oil pen to different components like the hair, the eyebrow, and the lips. So that's what I'm just basically doing. I have, a, I have videos and videos dedicated to just this. Now... I met a friend that I told him, yeah, I needed to, I mean, work on um, my Photoshop and crack it. And then he sounded like a beast, you know, when, when you sound like, I mean, this this, this thing I, I know how to do is for only champions. And it sounds funny, but yeah. So I felt really, really, really bad. So, I, I, hey, bro, I mean, you could help me do this thing. And then I got to tell me, say, ah, well, I can't. Well, he, actually, well, he did not say he couldn't outrightly, but then he gave me all these stories like, okay, I mean, later, 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 later. So one day I got really upset and I was like, what is all this nonsense? Uh, I was very, very upset. So I, I came to um, where I was and I told him, yeah, bro, like this doesn't make sense. And finally, I did crack it. I can't remember how now, but I know I did crack my Photoshop. And yeah. Then came the next part. You know, after you conquer one part, there's another part. Then it came the next part. The next part was I had a friend that was doing vector art. If you can remember vector art, more like opacity. You reduce the opacity to see the vector, the picture, the background. Yeah, the, it's just not so. So compared to what we are doing now, it's not extremely catchy. I don't feel like it's 
vector art is nice but that particular one we were doing was very very whack but yeah i told him and then he said he would always tell me oh okay bro i'm going to work on this uh, you know you know bro so basically i'm adding colors now yes i'm adding colors now to give the whole thing the whole feel and finally i just thought oh bro there's youtube i used to watch messi a lot on youtube and ronaldo why can't i learn how to do this on youtube i tried and i'm like oh yes this is nice but then when going on youtube i noticed that i could not use the paint tool so it was difficult then i just quit and i started doing other manipulations but finally one day when i was in my it then there's this part of the whole story that i needed to add to add in when i was doing my it so they would always tell me i'm strong this photoshop thing you are doing is very stupid just i mean cut the whole crap this is rubbish and i'm like bro i know what i'm doing and i like it but then eventually i pushed forward you know i pushed forward and then i felt like i was going to learn this thing i was going to learn it so one day um, i learned how to use the pen to with more practice i'm adding shadows and highlights now to make the whole picture pop up and then with more practice i learned how to do it and one day i was watching and i felt like oh that's true i like cartoons and now when after learning how to use the pen tool one day i went on and you would not believe how much i, I put in the whole night i was up and i was watching this tutorial and i was doing it step by step by step and oh boy it bust my head when the, when i was getting close you know sometimes when you really start how to make uh, making cartoons you feel like a lot of things do not make sense but they do make sense eventually so i'll finish doing the whole image pause from the story and let's let me let me explain what i'm doing so i finished in working on the whole image then i'll put the then i'll kind of reduce it then make the um the part of the body smaller then hide it right behind the main picture you know see add it right behind the main picture then probably just make a few adjustments to it and with the liquify i can always work on any part of the body i want and take out this part that look like blemish now after that funny enough like like six months later this same guy that i was trying to learn from one time he came back and he was one of my subscribers and he, he I, I actually taught him how to smudge paint and all those other things now the basic the bottom line or the f funny part of the whole story is i feel like I mean what you want to do you can do it if you want to do it if not you're just going to be there giving a lot of excuses and making excuses for yourself and yeah so this is what we have as a caricature and the drop shadows are very they feel very funny but if you like the video please don't forget to hit subscribe i'll meet you guys in the next